What it do, collective? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Girl King. Coming at you on this very soulful Sunday. Happy Father's Day to all you fathers out there. Get your son, get your son. Shout out to my dad, Mr. WLM. Happy Father's Day to you, sir. I'll be there shortly. So, collective, I have a very unusual reading for you today. We're going to be using Johnny Spirit Walker to see what is going on in the universe. So if you didn't know, now you know, Johnny Spirit Walker is full of fortune cookie messages I've been collecting over the years. Yes, I like Chinese food, leave me alone. Anywho, we will get some messages from the ancestors to see where this guidance is headed for you today. So this course is a collective message it is open to all signs please only take what resonates if it's not what rings true for you then it's not what it do so ancestors what is going on for the collective on this very soulful sunday and i knew it was coming out because i feel it collective it says abundance of softness Stellar blessings of the celestial goddess of abundance. It smells like money around here, is what the ancestors are saying. Do you see the wheat? Somebody likes wheat, Tina? I'm seeing, uh, what's that bread? Nature's Own Honey Wheat Bread. Got some carb lovers out there. So abundance is coming in for you, collective. So says the ancestors. It smells like money, collective. That's what I'm burning for you. I'm burning money for you, collective, because I smell it coming in. I literally smell the money. So some of you are going to be saying, show me the money. I'm seeing Jerry Maguire. Somebody likes Tom Cruise. What else is going on? Ancestors for my collective on this Father's Day. So we have popping out talisman of potency, charging sacred objects of power. So some of you have been collecting talismans. I'm seeing beaded bracelets. Some of you have been collecting crystals. Somebody has smoky quartz on their neck. I'm seeing uh, amethyst. So we have spirit of Isis, triumph of the goddess. Look at that collective. Tapping on into your intuition and your feminine size. Be you masculine or feminine. So we'll see what the messages from Johnny Spirit Walker have to say for you, collective. So we'll just shake these on now and see what Spirit has to say. That looks like enough. So now I will hold these up for you, but the camera does not like to adjust when I do so. So you can take my word for it. I love you. I got you. So we have a good position and a comfortable salary will be yours. First one out. What did I say about this abundance? Can you smell it yet, collective? Can you smell it yet? So prosperity is coming in for you tenfold, I'm hearing. So something could be happening for you in the form of abundance. I'm hearing a windfall within the next 10 days. Collective heroism is endurance for one more moment. So spirit is telling you, collective, to hold on, to keep on. Don't give up. The little engine that could. Someone here likes comments in the train. Chances of glamor and excitement are coming to you. <laughs> so some of y'all about to get real snazzy pizzazzy. I'm hearing appearance changes. A lot of you are doing shocking things to your hair, either be it by the cut or the color. Hmm. By the cut or the color. It says you will soon be the guest of a royal host. 
So some of you are going to be expecting company. I'm hearing a surprise. Someone is going to be popping up at your house with a surprise. It says a big fortune will de descend upon you this year. Collective, collective, collective. Are you ready yet? Are you ready yet, collective? Are you ready yet? This is what Spirit is asking. Are you ready yet? Are you ready to handle the tenfold of abundance that is headed your way? I'm seeing fistfuls. So some of you will be having fistfuls of money, fistfuls of cash, wads of cash. Hmm. The money is coming, collective. The money is coming. It says a big fortune will descend upon you this year. So a lot of you are going to be capturing your dreams this year because of certain abundance that is headed your way. We have a good way to keep healthy is to eat more Chinese food. So for those of you who just judge me for all of these messages I have for all of the fortune cookies, I've received on the tail ends of many delicious Chinese food meals, which are now giving you blessings in the message. Hold your judgment. What did I just tell you? Spirit said, hold on, pump your brakes, but keep going. So you know what you need to hold back from and what you need to push forward on is the message. We have all the troubles you have will pass away very quickly. Things are eclipsing out of your life and another one just passed. We just had two, a lunar eclipse and then a solar eclipse. So a lot of things that have not been resonating with you collective. Things that have troubled your spirit, your mind, your body have been eclipsed out of your life. So the ending of karmic cycles, where did it go? Okay, so on the back of this one that says a big fortune will descend upon you this year. My bad spirit said, so go back to that one. Uh, it says August on the back. <laughs> So money collective is going to be coming. A big fortune is coming for some of you in August. Listen here to what the messages are saying. Some of you like mangoes. We have get your mindset. Confidence will lead you on. So this is very much Leo energy, that fire energy, that Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, fire energy that got you all fired up. I'm all shook up, uh-huh, 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 I'm all shook up. Listen, someone likes Elvis, don't step on my blue suede shoes is what you're going to be telling somebody soon. Don't step on my blue suede shoes, you know I just got these bitches. It says if your work is not finished, blame it on the computer. Listen, listen, listen here, collective, we are not blaming things on the computer on the computer. We're not blaming things on the dog. We're not blaming things on our partner, on our kids, on our job, on our boss, on our car. We're not blaming things on anybody because the blame game is over. I'm hearing game over. So we're accepting responsibilities for our actions. Collective, we are maturing. Gosh damn it, we are blossoming. That is beautiful energy. It says, everywhere you choose to go, friendly faces will greet you. So a lot of you have been smiling more. And why is that collective? Because some of you have had that face covering off. And people can see you again, collective. You've come out of the dark. So a lot of you are blossoming and expanding and people can see it and feel it and they are responding to it because people, your heart is a battery and as such, it creates energy. Your heart creates an energy field and when your heart space is ablaze with love and compassion and empathy, people feel that. And so when they see you collective, they see and they feel that love, that energy. And so because they feel your friendly energy, that makes them 
feel friendly. Because they see you smiling collected, they start smiling. So friendly faces are greeting you. We have if you're dressed, if, <laughs> let me get my words right. So excited about this abundance for you, collective goodness gracious. This is how excited y'all are going to be. Some of y'all are going to be speechless at the windfalls that are coming through for you. Brother Wind is blowing something in the wind for you is what I just heard. Brother Wind is blowing a wind in the wind for you. Did you hear what I said for those of you in the back? Brother Wind is blowing a wind in the wind for you. It says, if your desires are not extravagant, they will be granted. So some of you have been working in temperance, not asking for too much, not giving too much. You have reached a state of equilibrium, of balance. I'm hearing emotional balance. It says, any troubles you have or any troubles you may have will pass very shortly. Again, and it's because you have developed emotional intelligence. So when things get you down, collective, you're able to transmute that energy and turn that shit around. So things don't get you down for long. Working in that heart space energy says share yourself and your possessions with close friends. So some of you have been in a very giving nature. And you know why, collective? Because this abundance is coming in and because you have more, you are able to do more. You are able to give more more you have you are a charmer who are you charming there collective look at me ripping the message so somebody literally wants to take a bite out of you collective so somebody is feeling saucy about you is what i just heard you got someone feeling juicy collective because you're a charmer this is libra energy so because you are bringing in that balance that self-love that I was just speaking of, collective, you are becoming more attractive. Not only in your appearance, collective, but in your energy. And that's where it's at. We have life is about making some things happen, not waiting for something to happen. So again, action, that Aries energy, making moves, shooting for the stars, that Sagittarius power, using your confidence to go ahead and make those moves towards the things that you desire, that's Leo energy. By helping someone today, you may also be helping yourself. What did I say about being positive and using that heart chakra energy when you are happy? You make others happy, collective. It's a no-brainer. It says, judge one not by his charms, but by his qualities. That's two cards. Or not two cards. Two messages. Two messages collective from Mr. Johnny Spirit Walker. It's just a container. I'm not a drinker. Only every blue moon. Only every blue moon. And only every blue moon collective does a windfall like this come through. And I'm telling you, it's coming for you. So says the ancestors. We have a love relationship takes on an added dimension. Can you get with it? Didn't I say abundance tenfold? Spiritual, physical, emotional. Celestial. Cosmic. Universal. How much is too much good stuff a.m. p.m. a.m. p.m. a.m. p.m. 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 you're getting paid you're getting paid collective you're gonna be telling somebody yeah pay them go ahead give them the money you know why collective because you got the bag you got the bag you got the bag i just heard you captured the flag I'm seeing Halo 3. You will surround yourself with warmth and riches. Collective, how many? How many? How much good stuff is too much good stuff? I mean, I'm telling you, the money is going to be coming to you a.m. to p.m. Some of y'all might not even have to lift a finger. The windfall that is coming for you, collective. I just can't contain myself. Oh, it says a great day lies ahead in the not too distant future. Yeah, because that money, the money is coming in collective. We have 
you will spend many years in comfort and material wealth. Now, <laughs> I'm going to try and get a shot of these when I finish this to let y'all kind of glimpse in, let you see the words for, for yourself. Because sometimes seeing is believing, but not all the time. Because you believe in spirit, right? You believe in love, right? You believe in air, damn it. You breathe it every day. Can you see it? The point collected is to have faith. And a lot of you have been putting faith in spiritual practices. You've been putting faith in your religion. You've been wearing things to remind you of your power. A talisman. Because you know that abundance is coming and that's why you go ahead and wear that talisman. It's either for protection or to bring in abundance. One or the other. It says a thrilling adventure is in your new year, in your near future. Get your words together, girl. We have executive ability is prominent in your makeup. So some of y'all are going to be making boss moves. Some of you are already executives making boss moves. Because you have the spirit of Isis in you. Don't you look like a boss? Oh, but she does. And oh, but you are collective masculine or feminine. You are a boss. So if you are not already an executive, you will be soon. The captain of your own ship, I just heard. So we have all the little things will add to a happy journey. This is a reminder, collective, not to let the small stuff get in the way. Declare peace every day. Move in love. Move with love. Do things from a space of love, and that will create more peace in your life. When you do things from obligation, collective, let me say this very clearly, because the ancestors want me to be absolutely crystalline, discerningly clear. When you do things from a space of love, it creates more peace in your life. When you do things from a point of obligation, that builds up resentment and that is a blockage to love, which then creates a blockage to abundance. I need for y'all to understand, to overstand, to understand that abundance and love are married. They're like this, always and forever, in all dimensions and all the realms, Abundance and love go hand in hand like a pair of gloves. Some of you may be getting a new couch. We have imagination is everything. It is the preview of life's coming attractions. So you're going to be getting more comfortable on this new couch. A lot of you have been comforting yourselves. You've been wanting to be more relaxed. You're getting more R and R. You're taking more breaks. You're building in the breaks. You're finding more me time. Imagination is everything. A lot of you have been using your imagination to venture out into new hobbies, new interests, new things to bring you peace. It says your kindness will lead you to happiness. Keep on expanding that heart space collected because the more love that you give unto yourself, the more love that is attracted to you. Good opportunities ahead. Set your mind to grasp the next step. So imagination, thinking, making plans, making concrete plans, collective about the certain abundance that is coming in for you. A lot of you are going to have to make smart money moves with this windfall that comes in so that it is lasting and sustaining. So that it is not God in the blink of an eye. We have stick to the basics. Be weary of novelty. So again, stick to the basics. <laughs> make sure that you're making those smart money moves. Don't just go spending this money. Dipping and dabbing, partying and mm, 
Take it how it resonates, but you know what you need to do with this money. Some of you, it's your first thought. Some of you have already had a plan in line for what you would do if you ever received a large sum of money. And for a lot of you, this has been a very smart plan from beginning to the end, and it's coming through for you. A lot of you, this is your fourth or fifth thought down the line. No shame, no judgment here. Point of the matter is to make sure that when this windfall comes through, that you do not mismanage these funds. We have an admirer is too shy to meet you. Be on the lookout and make the first move. Wow, collective love is coming in. You may have to open your mouth, though. You may have to open your mouth, collective, and make the first move. Are you in that Leo energy? Are you feeling your confidence? Are you feeling your confidence? Are you feeling yourself? I'm in the building and I'm feeling myself. Don't be overly suspicious where it's not warranted. So some of you know or have an idea, a suspicion, a hint of who this admirer might be. And Spirit is saying, don't be too suspicious of this admirer. Again, we must work on our heart space. We must open our hearts. You can't expect love if your heart space is closed. Where is the room for it to enter, correct? All right, it says, do not hide your feelings. Let others know where they stand. I can't make it up, Collective. I just told you, you gotta open your hearts, Collective. You gotta open your hearts to love in abundance. The ancestors said, you're gonna be having wads of cash, okay? Double down, twofold, two hands. says, life to you is a bold and dashing responsibility. What did I say earlier about taking responsibility, ending the blame game, ending that dangerous cyclical karmic cycle, pointing the finger, yet not realizing that three of those fingers are pointed back at you. So you stop that madness. It says a pleasant experience is ahead. Don't pass it by. Don't fuck up this money collective. Oh my goodness, please, please. So the ancestors were just showing me a glimpse of that show they used to have on TV where they would show people who won the lottery and like all the stuff that they, they did with their money and then how they lost it and how they were like broke and they just, they just fucking lost it all. They just lost it all collective. I don't want to see this happen for you. So spirit is cautioning you. Cautioning. Swipe or no swiping. Don't get out there when you get this windfall collective and just start swiping. Don't start swiping asses with these bills in the club, on these shoes, on these clothes. Put the shit down on something that is going to be sustainable that you can maintain and that you can draw from in the future. That is your hint. The last one we have, you will soon find a kindred spirit for a lasting friendship. That love, the love and the abundance collective, the love and the abundance is coming in. It's already here. If you build it, they will come. A lot of you are building up that energy. Putting faith in yourself. The talisman is just a reminder. It's just a reminder that you are protected. It's just a reminder that what you are manifesting, that what you are trying to bring into fruition is already here, collective. So open your minds, open your hearts, and receive the love and abundance that is so graciously being given, gifted to you by the universe, by source. I am Girl King, and I do love you. And I want you to know that this abundance is coming in if only you would open your hearts. I'll let you go.